What's up, guys? I just came downstairs. It's like 4:30 in the morning. I'm oh, so tired too. My nose is fucking itchy and all that. <coughs> it's sneezing and it's cold. Feeling under the weather. Oh, fuck it, energetic. But uh, yeah, guys, I gotta go eat some fruit. I'm gonna get ready. Make sure I get everything. Get everything over there, but I gotta get a couple more things. Wash my bottle. Blah blah blah, boo boo boo. <laughs> Nose is stuffy. Oh wow, this is right now. But I'm gonna eat some fruit. <laughs> Turn my phone. There you go, eat this shit. Oh, no good. Oh, bro, it's fun, man. Eh? <laughs> That's the worst, bro, waking up early. Tell you this, bro. You try to wake up work every day just to go, uh, wake up early just to go work. Oh, energetic, yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, guys. Never mind my stiffness. Let's get this shit up. So, I'm gonna go drink some water, eat some fruit. Take a minute. There we go. go. Let's get it. So, guys, I'm taking my shit right now, but I gotta rush my right coming right now, guys. My right coming right now. <laughs> Alright, guys. Welcome. Alright, so I was supposed to be picked up by my boy Jack, yeah? But he, he went flick on me last minute. He's like, oh, wait, I think you should just drive. So I was like, fuck, bro. So I get my luggage, my bag, everything. Hopefully, I get everything, boys. Okay, wait, hold on, hold on. Let, let me just um put the camera down real quick and let me start the car. Oh, fuck. I don't know why I'm kind of nervous, boys. I gotta go find parking and all that. So yeah, hopefully, it's good. At least it's a little bit windy. I can see. So let me make sure I have everything then. I'm gonna just get down there. Oh, fuck. All right, guys. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another video. But today, like I said, I'm gonna be going on a trip right now. But it's like 5:30 in the morning. My flight is at, or boarding is at 7 o'clock. Uh, 7:30 is when we take off. And uh, right now it's 5:30. I gotta go down there. I gotta go find. I gotta go park. I was supposed to get picked up by my boy Jack, but then he was like, "Oh no, no, change your plans. Just drive." That's like, "Fuck, bro." Okay, so I was rushing a little bit in the morning. So at least I got a little bit rush because I thought. I was gonna get picked up, so I was rushing a little bit, but then now I, I got to calm down a little bit. But then now the only thing is I gotta go find parking, bro. And I don't really even I, I never drove by myself to the parking structure. I know where it is, but I forget like which fucking you know the airport is all confused. <laughs> so alright guys, so my car's almost warmed up. Let me get a um let me just sip some water real quick. Where the fuck is my water bottle at? What the fuck? Bro, well, my water just went vanish. Oh no, it's ready. Right so let me get a sip of water. Let me drive down there and let me let me find where we gotta park. Get to my airline and find my boy Jack and we're gonna get this shit up on the road. So I'll go text you guys when I stay over there and we'll we'll see what's up, bro. We'll see what's up. So a BRB boys, yes sir. Bro L bro. Bro L. I'm row L, second floor, boys. All right, so in case I forget, guys, I just landed. I got parking and all, but I'm row L, all right, and I'm second floor. Bro, I was driving over there. I was like, fuck, I missed. I mi I was going to park in the other parking structure, but I missed them. And I was like, oh, fuck. Um, shit. I didn't, uh, fuck. <laughs> I was like, oh, shit. Now, I gotta. I just got to worry about getting out of this parking structure because I don't know where to go, man. But uh, I think I get to... Uh, no, bro. What, should, what should I do? How do I get across? There's no way to cross. So what I gotta do is I either gotta go to the bottom floor, like the bottom, bottom, and then cross, or I think gotta go up to the top floor and then cross. So right now I'm traveling on my own, boys. All right. So I never traveled on my own before. So shut the hell up. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna make sure I have everything. Uh, and then I'm, I'm gonna get situated. I got my parking pass and boom, boom, boom. Okay. And then from there, you know what I'm saying? Um, we're just gonna dip on. You know what I'm saying? So I gotta check my. Am I in the parking stuff? Okay. I'm in the parking store. I'm gonna meet my boy Jack and then we're gonna get this shit on the road guys. But oh bro, kind of nervous But I let go check in already find my way out of here and let's go. Let, let's get this shit out of here. All right, so wish me luck guys And yeah, just who oh, man. I don't know when I ain't no fucking nervous nigga, boy. What the fuck? All right, so catch you guys later boy hey guys look I'm in the elevator right now I'm trying to find my way out of here. So I'm going through level one. I'm gonna cross 
I gotta find wherever I gotta go for the school. Yeah. Okay. What's up guys uh you know I, I gotta interrupt the video real quick but anyways guys um right now it's february 6th when i'm recording this on monday 9 56 a.m i'm not working right now i'm done with my job blah 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 but anyways guys i just wanted to say today that um i wanted to explain the backstory of jack goff so if you guys haven't known um pretty much this whole video this whole vlog was pretty much me going on a trip with jack he's my enemy uh, pretty much we used to hang out together. Uh, we met at work before. It used to be me, my manager, and Jack. All three of us, we used to hang out, do this, do that. Uh, we used to go hiking. And we used to work together. Hold on, thing going up, yeah, bro. Oh wow, this is so good. Back the fuck up. Used to go, um, you know, we, we, was, we was always hanging out together. We used to go beach together. But anyways, one day, uh, one day me and Jack, we kind of, and uh, I'm a manager, we kind of had a fallout because like Jack would always be doing sus stuff. So like one day he'll be like fucking like, oh, he'll be like, um, We'll be hiking on the beach. Like, right there, bro. If you guys haven't known, we have this clip right here on the hike. <laughs> <laughs> like, nobody even... <laughs> but anyways, like, um, pretty much, we always go be hiking. And then one time, we went to this hike. And then, it was like, every Wednesday, we, every... Oh, God, I can't even speak. But every Wednesday, we used to go hiking and shit like that. And then, um, we used to go up. And then, we used to wake up early, go hike, go beach, eat some dinner, watch a movie at nighttime, hang out, cruise around. You know, we always used to be tight like that in a circle, you know what I'm saying? So, after that, um, when we was hiking one day, my manager, I, t I gotta tell you guys one little story real quick. So, my manager, he's like, hey, bro, I gotta go piss. And then, so pretty much, I was like, okay, okay. So, my ma I I'm turning around, I'm facing Jack. So, it's Jack in, in the front, then it's me in the middle, and then there's my manager behind me. And I'm turning facing Jack because my manager is uh, pissing. He's He turned around to go piss, right? So he's like, oh, bro, I gotta go piss. I'm, I'm gonna go um, piss real quick. Turn around. So I turn around, and then I'm facing Jack. Jack is standing at an angle to where if he turns around, he can see my manager's thing. But the funny thing was, instead of Jack looking the other way, the opposite direction of my manager, Jack was looking. I was fucking looking at Jack, and then I, 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 I hear my manager pissing. He's like, Psst, the water noise, yeah? And then on my own clear 4K eyes, bro, I saw Jack. He even turn around. And he was glancing down. He's fucking not looking up. He's looking fucking down, bro. He's looking down at the fuck, bro. I promise. He was like, he's, he was like, little clip right here. But pretty much he was doing sus stuff. And then after that, when he was hiking, I guess Jack was fucking turned on by fucking looking at my manager's thing. And then after that, um, something was fucking popping out his pants. Like he was shirtless on the hike. So there was no shirt covering his shorts and all that. And then there was like literally something like it was like sticking out the fucking shorts, bro. I was like, I was like, bro. This is not good, bro. I was like fucking dying. I was like, Jack, bro. No disrespect, but we homies and all that. But if you roll like that, no, no be doing that to us, bro. No be fucking trying to throw your, your fucking thing on us and like looking at us, making us feel uncomfortable. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not how it rolls, bro. You gotta know how to act in certain situations. So there's one clip too where, um, Jack, and then Jack was like fucking scared. He was about to like fall off or something. And he's like, tell my mom I love her. And then like, if, if he wants to slip down, it's like one little slope that we have to come down. And on top, us two was on the bottom. It was like, Jack, let's not do it. He didn't climb up. He's like, oh, I can do it. We can. Do. After that, he's like, bro, come down. I was like, come down, come down. It's dangerous. And then he tried to come down. It's like only one tiny slope. And it was so muddy and slippery. And his grip on his shoes was so weak. If he was to slide, it would have like freaking made him slide off the mountain. That, that's how like it was a bad angle. That's how dangerous it was. There was no barriers, nothing, bro. There's no bushes. The bushes was like, yeah, on the bottom when you fucking fall off. But I love her. And then he told, he told my manager, he's like, bro, he's like, bro, you, I love you, bro. I was like, what the fuck? Hey, what the fuck? 
And then after that, you know, I helped him get down. He somehow made it down and he was fucking shaking and panting. And then there's a clip right here where my manager was telling the story of what happened. Show it right here, guys. Show it right here. Okay, good. I don't know what to say, though. So, the guy was, um, so we went to the top, yeah? So, yeah. we went up here, yeah? Like, it was high up, yeah? And then what else happened, bro? Yeah. Make any kind, yeah? Yeah. Is it even recording? Yeah. You let me record you? No, I don't know. Okay, go, go. But, but, bro, so we was going up, yeah? We was going up this hill, and we was about to hit stairway, but then we... <laughs> We encountered this this um this steep hill and then when this when this nigga went <coughs> he was going up and then he came back down and his, he had his two arms like that as if he was humping the air before his you know, his last words but then um I told him Ali wasn't there so <laughs> you know he was trembling out of happiness no sarcasm at all and then he would give up man <laughs> 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 so now it's only us two yeah he's nowhere to be found look fuck a died already. Show them down there, bro. No more. No more anybody. No more, no more anybody in sight. Anyways, after that, we went down to the beach. Here's some beach story. So we was, you know, had waves and shit like that in the water. You know, get beaches and shit like that. Backstory of this. So just enjoy the rest of the video. And I'll update you guys soon. No cap. Let's go. Call button are located on the panel just above you. Please call on us if we can be of any assistance to you during the flight. On behalf of all of us at Hawaiian Airlines, thank you very much for choosing to fly with us. Mahalo nui loa and enjoy your flight. Oh, uh, no, you keep them. You just gotta show proof that that's your car and then... Is the I car? What does that mean? Wait, let me check the tag. It says on my tag. I don't like them send us back just because it's the wrong car. <clears throat> no, boys, I used to work over here, so I know what I do. I car, I car. I car. This is an I car. Yeah, so it's an icon. Oh, it's an intermediate car, so it's amazing. I'm the passengers for once. <laughs> What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I mean, welcome back, but right now I'm in the car. We got a Nissan right here, but pretty much guys, I was gonna, I'm going to tell you guys a little story after. So, we're at the hotel right now, it's 2.29pm right now, boys. You know, we've been chilling in the car, killing time since like 9 o'clock in the morning. And I got I to gotta tell you guys a little story about, about what happened. Jack, he came and saved the day, boys. So, I got to go. Working no more. Who's gonna bring me the joy that you bring me? Oh, every night. Alright, guys, another thing happened. We just got to the hotel. We got the keys. You put them in. The thing not even working, bro. So, you know what I'm saying? Very, very Maui Seaside. Yes, our boys. But, you don't get this, you don't get Got the, the key cards. The thing was on. We just didn't get them inside, and then the thing they even like work. I said, oh, oh. So, just a room. It's our room. <laughs> yeah, bro. I was like, oh, how can the thing not working? The thing not working. So, here we go, bro. Long day today, bro. It's a rainy day today, too. I mean. <laughs> oh, bro, I 
I gotta tell you guys some story later. That's it. Yeah, guys, so pretty much I had fucking troubles with the car rental. Right and then when I get to the hotel, we was waiting like hours and hours in the car. Finally get to the hotel at 3.15. We go inside. The thing wasn't even reset, the car. So I had to go back down, go back to the lobby. And now here we are again. Yeah, bro, look at this. Yes, sir. Boy, Jack over there. Yeah, guys, so we had a little bit rough start to the day, you know what I'm saying? So, first of all, we got to the first of all, I was supposed to get picked up by Jack, but Jack said, You know what, just drive. So, I was like, Okay, change your plan. So, I will drive over there to the airport, yeah. And then, once I got to the airport, I was like looking for parking. Then, I missed a, I missed a right turn where I was supposed to park my original parking structure, right? So, I kept going. I was like, Okay, what the next parking structure? I parked over there, we got parking, and after we got parking, or after I got parking. You know, I had to find my way to cross over to the other side to to get to the the terminals, yeah. So then I um, find my way. I had to cross. I had to go up, cross the bridge, come back down, and then I had to walk all the way down to my airline, which was Hawaiian Airline. I had to meet Jack. And then from there, all right, guys. From there, now the, the story don't end right there. So from there, we had to um, check in, blah blah blah. Got the tickets. Went TSA. Everything went smooth for the TSA check in. Blah blah blah. We got there by like. Um, 6 30 6 20 ish whatever and then we sat down at a gate and then we was waiting waiting around chilling 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 and then after that it was okay boarding and the flight came a little bit late so it was all coming like 7 30 or 7 20 we're supposed to fly out at 7 30 already was <sighs> This is the shower real quick, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna take a little beautiful shower. So when I take a beautiful shower, yeah, turn on my boo and then but look at this. Did anybody see that bro? <laughs> this stuff is clogged by Small toilet, no cat. Well, that shit clogged. Okay, so I figured out why the, the, the stuff was clogged was because this was up. That means the stuff in the drain was clogged. So you gotta push them down. Fucking stupid, huh? but I'm gonna go shower. I got my clothes right there. Hop in, got my towel, shampoo. You know, gotta get to work, no cat. All right, BRB. What's up, y'all? Look. Jack is sleeping. I'm going to have a cold day, Jack. So I'm going to have a cold day. What do you guys think, bro? Should I do that? Should I grab water? I'm going to have a cold day.
What's up, y'all? Good morning. <coughs> Time is it? 9.43 a.m., guys. Like, we're on a beautiful day. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Got on to the beach. Yes, sir. Like, we never knew what was behind it. And there was a little window that you could just look from the beast. What, could you open a door? No, she said. Was it like a handle? It was like a sliding door to it. Like, you couldn't. <laughs> Imagine like a sliding door that's locked. Uh, like, Why, you couldn't see through nothing? Was, was it like glass or anything? No. Like, just nothing? Just no, can't see. And it was like a wooden sliding door. Oh, oh, I see. I see. No, I don't know. So, I couldn't open at all. Like, yeah. even if you tried, like. What if you try to break it down physically? It'll probably break down. Yeah. Oh my. Yeah, so we're at the hotel right now, but it's only day two right now of being over here. And it's 9.06 p.m. So, bro, this whole trip was like fucking like, didn't have anything really to do because first of all, the weather was so bad. The first day we had so much shit that we had to go through. It was like flight problems, fucking car rental problems was a big one. Then you had to wait long time. And then we couldn't go anywhere. After that, oh sorry guys, I'm burping and shit like that. But after we got the car run on and all that, Wait, hold on, with my boy Jack, bro. Jack can go um over the summer. I can watch him out here. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna look out the window. Where the fuck did he go, bro? Did he already walk down there already? Or did they? Oh, come on, like like you stare at that. All right, so I'm gonna spot my boy Jack, bro. Like you fucking Jack, it's so fucking normal. That's like it's a Look Jack, like look on Korean. I'm gonna close the window real quick, man. Look, bro, like that. Like, like. Alright, where is he? Look. He's right there, look, look. He's right there, boy. Look, 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 look. <laughs> He's still over there. He went through the. So that's where he walks through. You gotta walk through over there. The hallway and all that. He will leave, so. I don't know what I'm gonna do, bro. I'm gonna do something real quick. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking do like this, look. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull him on his bed, bro. I'm gonna be like this. Oh, oh. Fucking show me on that, yeah. Sort of. So if you guys haven't known, Jack was the guy. He was the one touching leave. He doesn't have a key card, so if he come back, I might just lock him out while I do my video real quick. But yeah, guys, um, he went to go get something real quick. <coughs> he went over there, yeah. So I'm gonna go watch when he comes back. But he 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 has to go all the way down there, bro, to the parking lot and then more to the left. But I'm gonna spy on him, bro. I'm gonna be ready, bro. Anybody get one one sniper or something? One sniper. Cause if we come through, I'm gonna open it. I'm gonna bump men's and all that. So he sleeps over there. I sleep over there. You know what I'm saying? And it's 9:08 p.m. right now. But we just been chilling. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's been a, you know, the trip was. It's, it's all right. You know, get away from home and all that. But I got a lot of work to do. You know what I'm saying? But what I was like, bro, what can I be? Can, what can I be doing to feel productive right now? And so I was like, bro, I gotta be making videos. I gotta be recording. I gotta be doing all this kind of stuff. So yeah. But yeah, guys, the the whole the whole thing earlier was like fucking crazy because the first day we had like car problems, and then finally we got the car, but we couldn't do anything because the weather was so bad, boys. It was like freaking like freaking um like raining hard and cloudy. Today was a little bit better, but it was still kind of cloudy, but it's a little bit sunny and all that. 
uh but um yeah guys so it was like that and then when we got to the hotel we finally after waiting hours in the car and all that we couldn't do anything we we're just chilling in the car in the parking lot but fucking literally like four hour street doing nothing boy just listening to music on our phones trying to kill time felt like i was at work bro just trying to kill time and shit but uh he finally we finally checked in the hotel at 4 p.m and it was still raining and drizzling it was cloudy there's nothing to do so we finally got to the hotel we checked in and then after we check in, you know, I was a little bit nervous, bro. I was like, oh, what? They're going to let me use my... Last time, they, they only let me use credit card for um, the fucking car runner. But I'll tell you guys a little bit more about that story after when I get home. But when I got to the hotel, the debit card was good. They let me check in. It was easy process checking in. But once we got to the room, I swiped my key card. The fucking thing wasn't working. We got two key cards. None of them was working. So I ran down to the front desk again. I was like, yo, my, my key card not working. I don't know where Jack is, but he stayed on there. But he's like, oh, my key card wasn't working. And so, after that, I went down, blah, blah, blah. They updated the key card. And then finally, I got to the, we got to the hotel room. And then after that, we just chilling, chilling, chilling. I had to take a shit, you know, chilling, chilling. Chillin'. And then after that, we can get dinner and go out, get dinner. Then came back here and we can go rest and all that. And then I was just on my phone chilling and all that. And, you know, that was that. We slept. I slept. Woke up like 7, 8 o'clock in the morning, you know, chilled, killed some time, got some little breakfast, came back here, chilled again. We were supposed to go movies because it was raining and all that, so we was like, okay, what is the nearest mall movie? All right, we was going to watch Avatar, kill three hours of the day. The show was going to start at 3.55 p.m., so we got to like 3.45. We walked to the mall, we found a place, went inside, then after that, when we got to the movie theaters, we open the door, the fucking thing was closed, boy. I was like, bro, what? So after that, I was like, bro, there's no freaking way, bro. There's no freaking way. So then after that, we just walked around the mall, went, grabbed some food. I went Pizza Hut and we went Chick-fil-A, came back to the room, ate some dinner. Then my stomach was fucking gassy. Like, like this was only a couple hours ago. Like, I ate like 5.30 and then now it's only 9, 11 p.m. So I was just digesting, chilling. I was like fucking gassy and burping and shit like that. And fucking feel my stomach just felt stuck like nothing was trying to come out like you know what i'm saying but um yeah i don't know boys but i'm waiting for jack to return and shit like that so you know that was pretty much today and it's 9 p.m we're gonna i'm probably gonna try you know sleep soon and all that probably later on like 10 11 o'clock kill some time watch some shows text my chick but tomorrow's gonna be wednesday i don't know what we're gonna be doing tomorrow probably get some food in the morning chill maybe drive around a little bit but you know, there's nothing much to do. I've been here already. I've been a couple times. But you know what I'm saying? Just just a little getaway and getaway vlog. That's how I wasn't recording too much too. We didn't even go down to the pool or to the beach. But I guess we got to find other stuff to do tomorrow. Because all we've been doing is just chilling in the room. Driving around a little bit. But yeah, bro, I don't know. But look, look, look at this. They gave us this, boys. They gave us the Maui Seaside Hotel, boys. And he said, it come on my boys. Look, it says, Please enjoy these complimentary sustainable Maui Seaside water bottles. You may fill them at the wa filtered water dispenser conveniently located in the lobby throughout your stay. We hope you're ready. Okay, bro. But anyways, guys, you know, we got all the snacks right there. We got the Oreos, Nutter Butter, Chips Ahoy. You know, all the snacks. Parking at, back at home. You know, we, and you know what I'm saying, guys? This was like the first time that I traveled by myself, to be honest. I mean, not by myself, but you know what I'm saying? Like, um, fucking like, it was like, oh no, I'm gonna turn off the light, guys. If Jack come, I'm gonna sneak up on him. Yeah, okay. Turn off the light, bro. I'm gonna turn off the light real quick, boys. Just real quick. I gotta turn off all the lights. Okay. So Jack not see me through the window, bro. If, if he come up here, I'm gonna look like Michael Myers. Fucking, bro, I don't know where he at right now. He's supposed to be coming through this hallway soon. That's the entrance, or he could enter from there, but I'm watching both sides, so I don't know. What you guys think? But it looks kind of weird because people, if people look at the balcony or walking through it, they can see me staring down at them. So, oh, not, not creepy at all, yeah? But, um, yeah, guys, look, we got the, the best of Maui book and all that, you know, look at all these places. Put all my things up in here. Water bottles and shit like that, but, bro, bro, I gotta take a shit, too. I'm gonna take a shit soon. Oh, there he is, there he is. He's right there, bro. He's right there. He's walking down right now, bro. Fucking walking down right now, boys. Let me turn back, bro. Boys, so 
what I can do is I'm gonna, I don't know what I can do, bro. Get the people and all that, bro. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm gonna turn off all the links, I'm gonna be like this. I'm gonna turn them off. But, uh, yeah, guys. So, got pizza right there, man. It's old right I gotta toss this shit away. Like old food, man. It's a lot of food we got, to be honest. Yeah. Chick-fil-A nuggets and shit like that, boy. Look at that. Chicken, man. Should be up here soon, honestly. Oh, it goes on to the beach. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't know if this thing could go out. Because it could be water. I don't know if this thing could go out. Because it could be water. I think, I don't know. The beach. Yes, up, boys. Look, we get the pool over there and all that. And then we stay by the campfire. Fucking thing is hot, boy. Pretty nice, man. You get the chairs over there, you know. know. But we're just living, living the best life, you know what I'm saying? But might jump in the pool tomorrow night or something before you leave. I don't think you can leave my time, though, to be honest. But you're on the beach over there, but the beach over there. And you get the campfire here. Makes sense, man. Water no look, I don't, bro, the water's dirty, yeah.
up y'all but uh right now guys today's the last night last full day of our trip and stuff like that but tomorrow we're gonna go back home you know what i'm saying we're gonna go back home um but we have a kind of a long day tomorrow you know what i'm saying but we gotta check out all right we gotta check out we gotta check out at 11 and then after that we gotta kill time till 4 30 because we gotta return the car by 4 30 and from there we gotta go to the airport and then oh burp and then from there the flight is at 605 we take off at 605 so that's a good time you know to get to the airport 4 30 and you got like an hour or so just to prepare board the flight and then from there we're gonna be home by 7 o'clock p.m and then get my car i'm gonna drop off my boy jack and then we're gonna be home back working and shit like that and back to the lawn but from then on bro full-time youtube no cap but uh yeah guys i got my towel the shower and shit like that but i gotta make number two boy so i'm gonna go take off shit but we're gonna do a little tour right so we get the leaf blower and cup and shit like that and we got um he says help us in our efforts to reduce water and energy consumption as well as detergent wastewater towels on the rack but now we're getting blah 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 and get all these soaps and shit but so just tell them this then if if they don't switch you and all that you say oh i don't have to leave because the scheduling is like it's not accommodating my my flexibility and i was trying to communicate with all the bosses and everybody but they wasn't willing to switch my schedule or they weren't serious they wasn't communicating with me so I don't have to back out of this job because it's not working with my schedule. You can just tell them that, bro. That sounds professional. Yeah. Just be like, yeah, but you know, whatever I'm going, doing right now is not working out with this job. So, and the schedule, the flexibility is not accommodating my my own personal life schedule, so I can't stay in this job. And the job is ass. No, no, no. Yeah, yes. Just tell them. That. I get like twenty four just to. They're waiting for you. <laughs> yeah. They actually depend on me to do certain things, but you saw my problem. They don't even need people. So. No, right. then if they depend on one person, that that shows that everybody not pulling apart. <laughs> Fucking, that's ass, bro. That's not team, bro. Sorry, my situation, my last week, I didn't even feel bad already. I mean, I, can't, I, I feel bad like for like the good workers, but I was like, you just got to understand, bro. No one is keeping you here. This is like, you know, you got to make your own life choices, right? Yeah, you're not entitled like, to you, stay in Yeah, like, you're not stay in yeah, like, bro, I'm not committed to anything. I didn't sign a contract. Oh, I got to do this for five more years and shit like that. Like, when I and let leave, I can contract, leave. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, what is this? The NFL? Oh, I got to play for five more seasons. <laughs>
What's up, yo? What's up? This is the last day, but we're gonna leave soon. Check out us at 11. It's only 10 or 8 a.m., but fuck, guys. What's so funny earlier? I woke up like, you know, I was just killing time, so I sleep in a little bit till like 9, and then I finally got up like 9 20. And then after that, guys, I was having to, I was like, bro, I gotta shit and piss, so I'm gonna shit. And then, fuck, bro. I think I put too much toilet paper because when I flush the toilet, the thing never really fully go down. Like, I never see everything go, like, the water has to go all the way down, you know, like, like on freaking river. But then I was like, oh, fuck, bro. Hopefully the thing wouldn't flush. And then after that, I was, I tried flushing a second time. Then the water started rising. I was like, fuck, bro. Bro, the water pressure here is kind of, is ass, bro. Like, it's not strong. Like, you can tell. It's like, it's like some home, like, fucking, like, your, your broken toilet kind of thing. And, like, it was, like, trying to go down slowly. I was like, oh, wow, strong, yeah? So then, guys, I was like, the water started rising up. But good thing, never have doo-doo water come out. It was, only, it was like, clean a little bit, but then it stopped. It's, it rose a little bit, then it was spilling everywhere. But then after that, then it calmed down. And then all the water went back down. So I was like, okay, okay, at least never have a great flooding. Because I've been, oh, fuck, flooding in the bathroom. So I put all the towels and shit like that. It wasn't, good thing it wasn't that bad. I put all the towels... I put them lay on, on the ground so it can dry up and then I put all the dirty towels in the corner and then I was cleaning up that bathroom a little bit. Like, I wasn't touching the water or anything, but like as in cleaning up, I was like um making sure all the towels was on the ground. <laughs> and then after that, I was like, oh, fuck that. And then I just didn't jump in the shower, rinse off, shampoo, took a nice little warm shower. And I was like, bro, I ain't finna get sick, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't know, this, the, the past couple of days, my stomach was, I think I took my probiotics, that's right, so it's more sensitive. When I take my probiotics for my stomach, it, um, I guess it, it, it puts good bacteria, but it also takes out bad bacteria. So I guess you use the bathroom more. And so I think it was, my stomach was a little bit more sensitive. It was so gassy, like, the past couple of days, bro. Like, no matter how many times I try shit, there's, the, all the gas doesn't come out. I think because I don't like, get, I don't like shit too much over here, because like I said, like, hardly get toilet paper in the room <laughs> i want you one roll of toilet paper and then the second one is almost gone already so good thing we're checking out but the thing is what i gotta survive till fucking six o'clock p.m that's when we fly on 6 p.m and then i gotta survive pretty much to 7 p.m once we land at 7 p.m we get to um the fucking car and i'm gonna drop off jack home and then from there i'm gonna head home and do this and shower and unpack and all that but yeah, guys, I, I just fucking, I scared to get sick, okay? I'm just saying, bro. Like, I'm a paranoid motherfucker, all right? Like, last time, I, I there's no time to get sick. So, you know, I'm washing my hands for, like, fucking two minutes straight and hand sanitizer, drinking water, shit like that. Um, You know what I'm saying? So, there's no time to be sick, you know? I bought utensils. Look, I'm so smart, too. I bought fucking utensils. And instead of opening utensils at the front, bro, you open them from the back so that you grab the handle in case your hand is fucking dirty. All you motherfuckers don't even wash your hands after you, you, you uh, wipe your ass and shit like that. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm just being extra precautious because, um, bro, I got shit to do, bro. I got shit to do. But, yeah, so, probably gonna go um, check out 11. We got one hour to kill. And then from there, we're gonna relax, um, cruise around. I think get some lunch. I, I'm trying to tell Jack, let's go to the movies. The movies is at the mall nearby. And hopefully it's open. The last time we went to the movies the other day, the thing was closed. I don't know why, bro. It was temporarily closed. So hopefully this other mall, which is nearby, the movies is open. Uh, probably there's a film at like 1 p.m. And then it's like a probably like two hour movie. So come out by like three o'clock. And then probably we got to go crispy. We got to get some donuts to take home. So another 30 minutes, hopefully not busy. And then from there, we got to get to the airport, drop off the car at 4.30. And from there, chill, 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 check in. I think boarding is like 5.50 or 5.45 because the plane takes off at 6. So, you know what I'm saying? So, it's going to be a little bit fast. But, you know, hopefully my stomach, I pray to God. Thank you, God. Let's get this shit on the road. But, you know what I'm saying? No stomach problems, no getting sick, uh, no getting dizzy on the plane, no nothing. But everything smooth selling. Get everything on the plane. Already 10, 12, boys. 10 fucking 12, right? So, I got everything already packed. Just got to pack all this. That's all my hygiene stuff, my medicine, hand sanitizer, bottles. I got more water bottle in the car. Probably going to go Target after. Um, backpack, luggage, all packed up. Just going to clean up a little bit. And then from there, bro, we going to get the shit out of here, bro. We got to get out of here. 
and I, I kind of happy to go home because I got a plan shift for do and you know, I can I can just chill at the comfort of my house and this is only one but yeah boys I, I, like I said but I got no time to get sick so you know hand sanitize clean everything wipe my phone down like you know the drill bro you know the drill all right so I got what 10 o'clock is good so 11 12 1 2 3 4 I have six hours to kill, boy. <laughs> six hours. Six. What's up, y'all? I'm in there putting gas, boy. The Nissan, but we got donuts right there, boy. Bam. And you got all our luggages in the back, but you know what I'm saying? Right now, we are going. Um, we just finished a movie, bro. We watched a movie called Missing, and the shit was so fucking funny, bro. I mean, not funny, but like it was so entertaining. It was like a mystery, uh, kidnapping movie kind of thing. And yeah, guys. So we just finished the movie. It finished like about 3.20. Right now it's like um only like 3.30, 3.35. I don't know what time. But we got to return the car by 4.30. And we just got donuts to take home. These donuts that everybody likes. So we can take them home. And what you may call that, bro. Um, There's a car on, bro. Yeah, but um, it's like um, what you call that. We get like an hour to spare. Yes, sir, boys. We just landed, but I get I'm trying to find my car right now. I'm going up to the third floor, across the bridge. It says go to third floor for bridge to parking garage. Okay. Let's go. Oh, man. Yeah. I'm on the second floor, so. Well, we made it, one. We made it to Vegas. The garage. I'm saying I know what I'm doing, but. Cross the bridge, get to the parking lot. Go ahead. Oh, can't wait to go home. Come home, man. Come home, man. I don't know I was nervous to be here. <laughs> yes, sir. No cap. Now I gotta go down to the second floor, which is on my car. And I'm saying, bro, we out here doing shit important. No cap. All right, guys. So, like I said, I memorized where my car was, bro. I'm at um L floor two. So you know everything was crazy. You know the trip, like fuck, I feel like I was in prison. But anyways, I'm gonna go um warm up the car. And I'm gonna start driving, and I gotta pay. 
I think you gotta take this parking ticket and then you gotta pay. I don't know. I'm probably gonna pay cash. But uh, I'm gonna go head home, bro. And I'm gonna go unpack and do all this shit and all that. And I'm gonna just chill for. I'm gonna. I might pick up my chick later on. She wasn't with me though, so I was with my boy Jack. But you know, feels good that I left. Felt like I was in prison. You know, wasn't doing much. But you know, back to work. Uh, I got a lot of shit to handle when I get back home. So, yes, sir. And then look at my gas, boys. Fucking full tank. But I haven't been driving all week, so let's see if I can drive good, alright? So, let's get this shit on the road. I'll see you guys back at home. I'll update you guys later. Yes, sir, boo. Yes, sir, boys. I'm driving off right now. I gotta find my way out. But yeah, guys. Hit you guys when I'm back home. No cap. Oh, fun, uh. Bro, I just came from there. What the fuck? <laughs> yes up boys today's thursday night but hopefully tomorrow's a better day we driving right now we gotta get the fuck out of here oh bro my left arm is so up bro my left arm i don't know why bro fucking thing so so all right boys tomorrow's friday you know pray for a better day praise the